on to more Captain Ducks. Why, why this one's a captain? I don't know. Probably because he's got the TNT thing with the classic, uh, little classic trigger. Would it be called a trigger? Classic fuse. The fuse box at the end that you pump down like Wiley e. Coyote. I don't think those have been in use for ever. Oh, I believe. Crap. Um, I believe we need to deal with this. Oh, where the hell did you come from? Jeez. There we go. Get the Kamado Wizard. That's enough for the victory. I think this one... Okay. I'm trying to remember the, the formula here. I think it goes... Uh, red. Blue. Yellow, green? Hey, what do you know? How the fuck do I remember that? I don't know. Okay, let's move on. Take on... Uh, they already spawned one. Hold on. Let's step on the switch here. Doesn't seem to have done anything, but if we drop down and we can go around yet again, ignoring all these enemies because we have seen them before, and we've already been through this area, we can... Actually, I think we need to head this way. And this barrier is now down. So now we're free to go around this way after going in a complete circle. But uh, what are you going to do? It's what the game requires. Hey, you didn't use it on me. Oh, it actually did damage to, to Yonsei. Damn it. Don't use that on me. You know you want to use that ability on me. Down it finally goes. Die fierce head. You know you need to die as well. You cannot live. Captain Duck is back. We can't let him trail us like that. Unfortunately, we really can't. I can't run past this guy because he's going to cast Exploder. It's just what he does when you're not paying attention to him. Keep on hitting him. Is that a, um, oh, it's a metal crawler up there. I, I barely see it there, but that is what that is. Exploder level 5 doesn't do crap anymore because I got the gauntlet. Very nice gauntlet. Have I mentioned how much I love that gauntlet now? Let's head... I don't think it matters. I don't think there's anything here on either side. I think they lead to the same spot. They do. They do. And we've got what look like new enemies, but they, they look like what we fought as a boss before. Let's see here. We got Dark Stalkers. Yeah, just like I thought. Uh... If I could ever get a hit on these guys, that would be appreciated. But yeah, they how weak of a boss are, is that last guy? They are now random enemies that we find here in this dun in the next dungeon. That is ridiculous. No other boss is like this as far as I remember. This is the only one where you not only find it one at a time, you find them in pairs in the next freaking dungeon. All right. Cure everybody! Should be more than enough. Yes. Yes it is. Like I said, almost full heal every damn time. We got another Captain Duck here. Uh, and he's walking what look like turnstiles to me. Looks like we have entered the modern age here. It looks like uh, where you go when you want to get in like a subway and they need like an official count. Like or a stadium or something like that. A little turnstile. Of course, I, I live in Anaheim. What am I talking about? It looks like Disneyland. Damn it, I was in the middle of killing you. You had to do that right then. Uh, this is probably going to be a Royal Jam, which I can't hold on to. Royal Jam won't fit because I have all enough already. It is a subway. Holy crap. Look at you, dude. You're on a subway. What kind of ninja takes the subway? What the hell is your problem? Die. Um, can't go through there. Can't go in those... Where the hell did that ninja come from? I mean, I would say that's a good ninja, but he's not supposed to let us see him at all. So, still a bad ninja. God, he's not even the toughest enemy here. <laughs> Alright, let's 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 get on. And we've got ghouls! Um, yeah, just just ghouls. <laughs> what do you want me to say? <laughs> They're, they're, they're regular ghouls. We have seen these guys before. <laughs> we have seen them for a long time now. 
And probably something that won't fit. Candy. Very nice. I'm always hoping for money, actually, at this point. Money is probably going to be the best thing. Um, we can go over and find more moonwalking ghouls because they are Michael Jackson fans, even though they don't understand which one he moonwalked in. And it wasn't Thriller, damn it. He didn't moonwalk in Thriller. And I may play a game that proves why I know that. <laughs> Eventually, I might get around to it. Oh no, speed up! His evade is up, though. that's what's important. So we have to fight our way through the zombie train. Why is there a train in the middle of the fortress full of zombies? It's best not to ask questions, probably. Candy still won't fit. Don't use that kind of stuff at all. I have magic for that now. Uh, I've kind of always been that way in RPGs. Always, uh, you know, you save magic for, for boss battles and you use items never. <laughs> it's not necessarily the smartest thing. There we go. Weapon skill up. Sword reaches level 6. I don't think there's anything else for him to work on at the moment, though. Um, he's pretty much waiting on the, the, the spear. Uh, so we'll have to wait for Shion to finish up with that before we can move him over. And then she can move over to something else that I know she needs to work on. There's something. There's something. I think the... Oh! Oh! Eggplant Man! We have seen him before! Not that difficult. Don't even need to really do that much. And just run off the, r the moving train. Who cares? We made it on the other side and we got two of these guys. Let's continue down here, and we can take on a ninja popped out of the ground. Not doing that much damage to any of us, though. <laughs> Not doing very much at all. Down there it goes. All right, we can head out of the turnstiles. Like I said, very, very strange that there would be. Well, I, you know, you can call it a train. It looks like a subway to me. Uh, I've never been on a subway, though. Actually, now that I think about it. But that's what it looks like to me. Oh, you're a dick. You spawned that right as I was ready to kill you. Can I get anything off the metal crawler? He does use wall. I don't see why I wouldn't be able to. 31 MP. Oh, God. That makes this so much easier. Uh, but, of course, this guy can cast wall, so I'm not going to risk uh, using this on him. Otherwise, I might have to heal. And, of course, Shion doesn't have an ability to get her MP back. Just Yonsei. And there is Wall. But down he goes. Down he goes. More ninja! Yeah, this guy was supposed to be a boss in the last place that we were, more or less, before here. I mean, it was only, what, two dungeons ago? Well, technically it wasn't a dungeon. But you know what I mean? We had one small little dungeon at the end of which we fought ourselves. And then before that, there was that guy in the Republic of Tasnica with the king. Still, still not, still a little unsure about calling yourself a republic when you have a king. Of course, now that I think about it, England refers to themselves as a constitutional monarchy, so thank you to anybody that answered that, but I figured out what you guys call yourselves just by remembering it. Now, there should be a secret switch around here. There it is. On the right side, so we can head through. Constitutional monarchy. That is what you guys call yourselves. Uh, you don't call yourselves a republic, though. A republic definitely implies um, ruling by uh, an elected group of officials instead of a, a king or a queen. And as far as I know, you can't elect a king or a queen. Um, they can assume power, but uh, they're, they're not elected. Now, I don't know of a system that works that way. I can't think of one off the top of my head, um, but I'm pretty sure there isn't one. Okay, yeah, we just want to head down here. <laughs> I'm paranoid about missing something in this, this dungeon. I, I'm a little uneasy about it. But we have found the thieves again. Hey, you. I did some nosing around. Seems this kid is the legendary knight. How? <laughs> what a joke. How could you have found that blade? Hand it over. Well, it kind of found me. Yeah, we're gonna be rich, boss. Shut up and go get it. Y y you're gonna try? Super Special Deluxe Robot Type 2 with Turbo! Kettlekin! 
and it is boss time yet again. We're up against this guy. It is well, as you might guess, it's an upgrade thing we fought from these guys before. I forgot what the last one's name was, but it was clearly another robot. This guy is probably not going to be nearly as difficult for me as it was last time. I don't. I probably don't even need to charge uh, my weapon anymore or anything like that. Uh, lucid barrier that will protect him from physical attacks for a little bit, but it, I think it protects against physical attacks. That's what it sounded like to me, but he's going down pretty damn fast afterwards, after that wore off. And you do need to keep away from that, unfortunately, uh, but I got so many, so much time to heal that it's not really going to be that big of a deal for me. Just keep hitting him. Lucid Barrier again. But down he goes. Like I said, this guy is not difficult. Don't worry too much about him. Down goes the Kettlekin. And we celebrate and it... Okay, Yancy and, and Xion, you're a little too close there. Way to go. Thank you. Thank you very much. And for that, you get a Bozor. Very simple. And we're back against these guys. Too strong. He's the real knight. What idiot said he wasn't the knight? Let's scram. Yeah. That's the uh, scorpion army, by the way. You can tell by the little logo on their back. But I don't think they ever fully introduced it. And we're back on the outside. You really had to cast Defender on yourself? Are you kidding me? Fine. Well, we beat you anyway. And it looks like we've gone a complete circle here. I think that we, we can head up, and here, yeah, it looks like we're, we're pretty much back the way that we came. Is Gemma still hanging out up top? Gemma? I don't want, yeah, I don't want to deal with you. I want to talk to Gemma. I don't want to deal with the friggin' metal qual- He's not here! Damn you, Gemma, why did you run away? Can I go through here? Will this lead the path forward? Still can't go this way. I swore that he was up the stairs again. There he is! Where were you last time, dude? Thanks to you, we found a shortcut to the Grand Palace. Really? C could you point me to it? Because I... Well, I guess we, we opened one up. We might as well take those guys out. Alright, so... I think you have to talk to him, to be honest with you. I, I don't think you can avoid it. Um, I don't really care about these guys anymore. I am well leveled now, and I'll be doing more grinding off screen. Not against those guys, though. Those guys, can, those guys take too damn long to kill. Nope, come on, we're leaving. Stop doing that. And... Wait, these are new, aren't they? This door right here? This looks new to me. And here we have Stone Saber. We got a few new enemies in here. Uh, but I think this is um, I think this is actually the entrance that we were looking for. Uh, but I don't want to go through here just yet. Instead, we are going to cut it here because I'm going to do some more grinding. And uh, when we come back, I'll probably be uh, fully upgraded all the way, everything up to uh, level 8, maybe even a little bit, well not everything up to level 8, uh, but at least the magic up to level 8, and we can uh, upgrade the, the magic as far as it'll go, which, uh, yeah, the magic will go to level 8, the weapons will go to whatever highest that they can, and we have, I believe, a couple items to get. So that's going to do it for these parts of Let's Play Secret of Mana. I've been Bella Scuba. I've been joined, as always, by my very powerful squad of Jake, Shion, and Yancy. Hope you guys have enjoyed these parts. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.